that has been achieved. All this, mind you, by a man whose limitations of knowledge when I met him were as startling as was its profundity. Opinions may differ as to the importance of Ramanujan's work and the influence it may or may not have on the mathematics of the future, but one gift it does show is its profound and invincible originality. Mr. Littlewood once told me that every positive integer is one of Ramanujan's personal friends. I believe this to be true. He told me that an equation for him had no meaning unless it expressed a thought of God. Well, despite everything in my being said to the contrary, perhaps he is right. For is this not exactly our justification for pure mathematics? We are merely explorers of infinity in the pursuit of absolute perfection. We do not invent these formulae, they already exist and lie in wait for only the very brightest of minds, like Ramanujan, ever to divine and prove. So, in the end, I have been forced to consider who are we to question Ramanujan? Let alone God. <coughs> Thank you.